Hi, I'm Danny Hester, bodybuilder, pro fitness trainer, and inventor of exercise equipment. Today we're going to talk about plyometrics for the shoulders. Make sure when you're doing any type of shoulder movements that you warm up with external and internal rotator cuff exercises. That will get the blood flowing and make sure that you're nice and loose and there's no impingements. Anytime you feel an impingement when you're going to do an exercise for the shoulders, stay away from that area and make sure you warm up more and stretch out. So plyometrics means explosive movement. You don't have to worry about the negative as far as supporting the weight coming back down. But do remember that when you come back down, it's a controlled position where you're not just letting it drop anywhere because that's a high risk factor also. And make sure before you explode and do the plyometrics, whether it's over the head or a push-up position, that you're set and you're doing it from a controlled position as far as the starting position. So you can do half reps, which means explode just halfway, whether it's a push-up position or overhead press with a kettlebell, dumbbells, or your body weight, uh, you make sure that you're trying to explode and make sure that you are controlled the weight coming back down. So those are the key tips in explosive plyometrics for the shoulders. I'm Danny Hester. You can find me at gflex.tv.